Today we will learn how to find the successor and predecessor of a given number. The number that comes before is the predecessor and the number that comes after is the successor. So let me give you an example. Suppose the number is 29. Predecessor will be the number that comes before that is 28 and successor is the number that comes after after the given number that is 30. So the before number is 28 that is the predecessor and the after number is 30 that is the successor of the given number is 29. Let me give you another example. Suppose the number given 250. So the predecessor of 250 is just the before number that is 249 and the successor of 250 is 2. 51. So 249 is the predecessor and 251 is the successor of the given number 250. Now let me give you another example. Suppose the number given 300. The predecessor of the given number 300 is 299. That is the number just before the given number. Just before means 299. And the after number that is the successor is 301. Let me show you another example 2501. So the predecessor of 2501 is this is a four digit number. So if we think we are confused how to find the predecessor we can easily do the subtraction that is 2501 minus 1 which is equal to 2500. So the predecessor of 2501 is 2500. So how we find out? We just subtract 1 from the given number. Then we get the predecessor. We know that the before number is the predecessor. But now in case of bigger number, we just subtracted 1 to find the predecessor of the given number. Now, when we find the successor of 2501, we will do 2501 plus 1, which is equal to 2502. So, to find the successor, we just added 1 to the given number. I hope this video is helpful to you. Please like, share and subscribe Math Only Math for more videos. Thank you.